Oh, it's a Groffle. Well, hello there, Groffle. I ain't gonna hurt you. Hold still, buddy. I just, I just want to see your face. Can I see your face? <laughs> Hold still. Come here, you. Can I ride him? Oh, oh, I can ride him. Come here. Hold still. Oh, just let me ride you. Oh, come on. <laughs>my friends and welcome to yonder the cloud catcher chronicles my name is nos and this game i have never played but it looked really interesting so uh i'm just gonna make sure all the visuals are turned up um let's go for ultra turn on ambient occlusion ultra Field of view, absolute maximum. Because my PC should handle all of that. No problemo. Okay, let's jump into it. Like I said, I have no idea what to expect because I've never played this game. But it looked super fun. So, we're going to give it a go. Uh, I kind of have a little bit of a tan going on. Um, my hair is about that color. Sure. Body shape. I can have big pec muscles. I can be kind of chunky. Or kind of skinny. Uh, I'll be right about in the middle. Eye color. Mine are pretty greenish, hazelish. And male sounds good. Okay. Good enough for me. I'm kind of glad it doesn't have too much optimization because uh, I get a little too carried away sometimes. Our dearest child, it broke our hearts when we sent you away, but it was the only way to keep you safe from the darkness that poisoned our land. When the day comes that you seek the truth, trust in the celestial compass to guide you. It will lead you far across the sea, into darkness and into light, but it will always lead you home. Home to Gemma, Gemia, Gemia, I'm not sure how to say that. Water looks cool though. Is that my boat? My ship? I think that's my ship. And that's me. Maybe. Hopefully. Is that my guiding compass? Oh, yeah, all right. Ooh, this game looks pretty already. F to talk. Ooh. Jib the sailor. This is amazing. I thought Gamia, Jamia, I don't know how to say that, was just a made up tale. I'm glad I came up from the kitchen to see this. I have to press enter every time, really? Can I just push F? That would help. Luff the sailor. I can't see you, dude. There's just bottles now. Looks like your compass is pointing into that bank of fog. Looks pretty thick. I'd best get up to the bell. Okay, you do that. I'm gonna explore this here ship. Hi. Who are you? Tack the sailor. So, the legend is true. There really is an island kingdom. I wonder if we'll see any strange new creatures. Oh, I can't just push F. Captain Pullen, if that compass of yours is right, Jimia should be just behind, behind that bank of fog. Are you ready to finally see the island? Are you ready to finally see the island? Uh, I guess so. Let's, let's go check it out. I don't think there's a whole lot more I can do on the boat. I couldn't seem to go in here. Oh, first person mode. Oh, no. Okay. My camera was just stuck. Aww. Wow, this isn't looking good. Yeah, it's getting pretty stormy. Are we going to get uh, shipwrecked? Oh. By the way, our sails aren't down. Oh, that's not good. Airy, 
Fear not, Sprite Seer. You and your friends are safe. You will see them again, but first you have a great task ahead of you. Wow, who are you? Yeah, how is my boat sailing so quickly with the sails up? Whatever. I am Airy, once a proud protector of these lands. I have been waiting for you. Please, may I see your compass? No. It's mine. All right, fine, I'll show it to you. Um, guiding light. Uh, okay. Set task. J and L is to rotate the camera. What? That's bizarre. Okay, can't I just, uh, yeah, do that with the mouse? That works for me. I like the mouse better. Delete to toggle details. That's weird setup. Okay, whatever. Guiding light. As soon as we spotted Jimia, the sky shook, the seas roared, and lightning struck. The ship went down, and I awoke in a strange new place. Okay. So, uh... So much for that. Airy, as I thought, a celestial compass. Use it whenever you are lost. Okay, am I lost now? It will guide you truly, but for now your path is blocked. My family can help you, but they themselves are lost. Find them and they will lead you home. Now, Sprite Seer, awaken. Your journey has only begun. Okay then. I like the art style of this. My dude is pretty damn quick. I like that. Can I can I smash stuff? Huh. Okay, maybe not. Am I going the right way? Ooh, sparkly. You discovered stone. Okay, is that a good thing? I'll take these rocks, I guess. What's that strange blue glow? I don't know. You tell me. Oh, Lumi. Oh, a human. It's been a long time since I've talked to a human. All of the people who could talk to me have gone away. Please take me with you. I don't want to be alone anymore. Okay. I found a sprite. Cool. Is this another stone I can take? Sure is. Is there anything else I can find over here? I like me some secrets. Do I get a beat on stuff on this game? I would sure like to swing a sword or shoot a bow or something cool. Nope, no goodies there. Onward! Mushrooms? You discovered mushroom. All right, I'll take it. I'll go have me a nice little hallucination later, I guess. Whoa, camera whips around pretty damn quick. <laughs> Lumi. The way out is just past the murk. It's bad stuff for you humans, though. I'll try to get rid of it, but I am not sure if I can do it alone. So, the premise of this game is that there's a whole bunch of different islands, and each island is like a different biome. And uh, the only way to get through each area is to disperse the murk with the help of these little fairy friend dudes, I, I believe. Phew, that was hard. I wish I had my brothers and sisters to help me out. If we work together, I think we can find them. Okay, let's go look around. Bubba! Wow. Ooh, what's that little slimy thing moving around right there? The field of view is kind of weird. Oh, there's a village over there. Let's go check it out. You really aren't looking the best. I bet we can find some help there. Remember, if we get lost, you can use your celestial compass. 
it's useful to map out your travels too. Anyway, let's head over there to the village. Okay, one merc cleared in the grasslands. Seven more to go. Oh, you're really gonna like follow me around, huh? That's cool. You remind me of Spark on Spyro the Dragon. For some reason. Ooh, treasure. Red shampoo? Just in case, you know, gotta keep my hair nice and clean. Gotta keep up my appearance for the ladies. And apparently I collect sticks. Ooh, what's this? What's that strange blue glow? I don't know. Where? What blue glow? What are you talking about? Can I get... Can I blast that or bash it? Something? I guess I'll just pick up some more sticks and rocks. You never know. I might need to build stuff or something. Flowers? Can I take those? Shit, yeah. Celium flower. I don't know if I should keep the field of view up so high. It's kind of messing with me. Let's let's turn that down just a smidge. Hmm. We'll just try that. Oh, it's still a little goofy when I look up, but maybe that'll be a little more natural feeling. What are you? Okay, I guess you're just weird little inchworms. Oh, what was that uh, inchworm guy on? Oh, yeah. Um... Oscar the Grouch had a little inchworm buddy that looked kind of like that guy. Man, I haven't seen Oscar in over a decade, probably. What's this place? I got some vine. Okay. Oh, handy that. I have me a handy dandy lantern. Ooh, that looks like Merc. So. This looks like stuff I can mine or something, maybe. Probably need a pick for that. Yep, this looks like the Merc. Ooh, look, little glow bugs. Little glowy bugs. Is that going to hurt me? No, I just can't go through it. To purify the Merc, you must use sprites you have found. So I need two sprites to get through that Merc. Okay. Well, let's head to where I was told to. Seek help in Fairmont. Speak with Master Low. Okay. Let's head to the village since it's getting dark. It sure got dark fast. Wow. Day one, year one. Spring. Oh, I love the little glow bugs. Oh, did I miss a vine? I missed a vine. Let's get crafting. You can't craft items. You can craft items through your journal. Tab. Um. Collections. Crafting. Twine. Did I? Oh, I just crafted twine. Okay. I just click on it and that's how I do it. Warm milk. Meow. Why am I... Why am I hearing a kitty cat? Meow! Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty. Hmm. Oh, I don't see a cat, but I definitely heard one. Hi there! If a villager has a exclamation point, it means they want to talk to you. Hi, dude. Fairmont. Ooh. Master Low. Hello, traveler. You look like you've been through some hard times. Please come inside. I can offer you some warm food and a soft bed. Why, thanks, dude. The townsfolk warmly welcome you. Well, that's good. Once your belly is full and your worries are eased, your head hits the soft pillow and you drift to sleep. Hee hee hee. Hee hee hee. There, that's much better. You look ready to face the world again. Sh should I give him a, uh... 
An old man voice? Just one more thing before you go. Ever since that terrible accident years ago, Merc has been popping up all over the place, making life difficult. But the people here are friendly, and we love to share what we know. Ask around and you'll soon have all the skills you need to make your way in this world. You have new clothes. Press tab to check them out. Okay. Tattered coat, tattered breeches. Uh, is that what he gave me? You may have survived the shipwreck, but these breeches certainly didn't. Uh, and this coat certainly didn't. Okay, what is all my stuff? Oh, a basic tunic. Traveler slacks. Cool. So here's the stuff I wore before, and here's the stuff he gave me. And a canvas rucksack. Unkempt short hair. <laughs> Red shampoo. Okay. Key items. None. Crafting. Collections. And my backpack. Okay. Guiding light. Sprites have the ability to clear Merc, but it drains them. So the stronger the Merc, the more sprites I need to help me. Okay, I think I got it. We've got a message board over here. Can I read that? I am looking for cloth. Three. If you bring them to me, I will reward you. Merrick. Uh, sure. I'll accept your quest. Sweet. This game's pretty cool already. Huh. Oh, there you are. That storm that capsized your boat, it also destroyed the East Docks. Now that's a big problem for yeah. us. This is a trade guild, you see. Without the East Docks bringing in goods, we're not in any position to help you out. Let's see here. Take this mallet and gather th some stone for Marina. Eight stone should be plenty to prop the East Docks yeah. back up. You'll find stone around the grasslands and near cliffs. Once you've got enough, deliver them back to Marina on the beach. Cool. Okay, I got a mallet. Wow, there's a lot of people that want to talk to me. Do you guys trade stuff, I take it? Trade. Ooh. Shop stock. This is my stuff, I see. So I can get an axe, a pickaxe, a fishing pole, and a sickle, and a trap. Cool. Do you have the same stuff, or do you have different stock? Oh, you got herb seeds. I can plant some herbs. Meadow bell seeds, potato seeds. Oh, so I guess I'm going to be doing some farming on this game, huh? I'll take that stick. Hi there. Who are you? Yeah. Her. Oh, hi. I heard there was a new face in town, so you want to learn the ways of a trader, huh? Well, it's not all just swapping stuff for other things, you know. A trader has to get creative, mm. too. Here, go grab me a vine and three sticks, and I'll share a trade secret with you. Well, too bad I used my vine to make twine. Okay, let's go see what this guy says. Oh. Oh, it's a chicky. Oh. I think. With a kind of a deep voice. Minnie, I hear you're in need of a roof over your head. Well, yeah. you're in luck. The old farm in the south field was abandoned when the Merc appeared. If you can clear the Merc, you're welcome to the farm. I'd love to see the old place patched up and running again. Take this axe and gather some materials to fix the place up. Sixteen wood and five sticks should be plenty. The farm is in the south fields through the big tunnel. You can't miss it. Okay. Is that where I just came from? Pretty sure it was. So I gotta find another sprite to clear that Merc. I got me a bundle of sticks. Cool. Do I have enough sticks to build the farm already? There's a rock down here. I'll take a rock. Why? Why do I keep hearing kitties? Oh, there's a kitty. Hi. Oh, my God. He's so cute. I took him. One cat found in the grasslands. Eight more to go. Well, I heard one. He was just over here. Um, shit, where was that? It's daytime now already. Wow. 
Time sure goes by fast. Wonder if all these goodies I'm picking up out here respawn. Oh look, there's like moose or something out there. Oh, it's just a little wormy. Hi, worm. I don't remember what that worm's name was. Oscar's worm. Look, it's a fox! Discovered animal. Grass fox. You're not gonna hurt me, are ya? I don't know if this game has fighting or anything of the sort, but it's super cute. I like it. Oh, it's a groffle. Well, hello there, groffle. I ain't gonna hurt you. Hold still, buddy. I just, I just want to see your face. Can I see your face? <laughs> Hold still. Come here, you. Can I ride him? Oh, oh, I can ride him. Come here. Hold still. Oh, just let me ride you. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll leave him be. Um, I have six out of five sticks, but I don't have wood. Can I chop this tree down? I think I can chop this tree down. Um, oh, hi, kitty. That's where I heard a kitty. Yeah, I think I was right by this rock right here. When I heard the meow meow kitty kitty. Yep, okay. So, oh, I got wood? Nope, still don't have wood. Okay, how do I... Nope. Here we go. Um, where's my stuff? Wow, look at all this shit I can craft. I didn't even notice there was all these other tabs. Carpenter, constructor, tinker, brewer, tailor, master. Wow. There's so much shit I can craft. Cool. Okay. Let's... See about equipping. Up oh, here, it here it is, my axe, a trusty axe used for chopping down trees. Okay, how do I use it? Um, Q and E. Keep swinging and chop this tree down with F. Damn! Mess that tree up, dude. Sweet. Bam. Hells yeah. Dude, this kid doesn't mess around. Wonder if the trees grow back. I don't want to deforest the place. Okay, there's a vine over here, I think. I'll take that. Hmm. All right, I didn't explore all of the town yet, I don't think. Let's go. Let's go take another little walk around the town. Oh. I can smash this rock. Blam! Hell yeah. Dude, this kid doesn't mess around. It smashes that shit. Okay, well, maybe I did explore all of the town. It's pretty small. Can I go in the houses? That'd be cool. Can I go in your house? Please? Aww, oh, I guess not. Why not? Your house is cool. Hmm. Well, this is a very tiny town. Oh, is that Merc? Can I get through this Merc with one fairy dude? To purify the murk, you must use sprites you have found. Nope, I need two. Damn. Oh, I bet I can smash these now, though. Blam! Red berry seeds. Cool! Oh, I dig it. This game is fun. Okay. Is this the dock? Are you kidding me? How can they bring stuff in in this tiny little place? Gold Lake. No, this isn't it. This is just another little village, I guess. Wow. Hi, dude. 
Theodore. Ahoy! Arr, I've been away from the open seas for far too long. I have a hankering for a knucklefish. You get me one of those beauties and I'll give you something good. They live in salt water. Here, take my old fishing pole and head to the beach. See if you can land one. I guess you could always find someone to trade you one, too. Either way, get me a lovely knucklefish. Okay. Can I break all this stuff? Guess not. Hi, who are you? Genevieve, there's a rumor that Bobintoff is desperate to get rid of all their clothing goods. Okay. I hear Bobintoff has got way too many clothing items. Head there if you're after some. Uh, sure. And this guy's a trader. Not a traitor, but a trader. Hmm. He's got dip fish. I think I'm good. I don't really want to trade anything just yet. Oh, I'm bummed I can't go in any of the houses. That's something I love doing on games. Exploring all the different little houses and stuff. Oh, what did I miss here? A stick. What's this, mud? Clay! Oh, close enough. Cool. Well. It's nighttime again. Ooh, ooh. Let's go see if I can break this stuff. Uh, nope. I guess I would need a pickaxe for that. Huh. So, um... How do I, uh, save and... Do I need to, like, spend the night somewhere? How does this work? Boing, shaboing, bing, bong. This town, it's so small. I'd hardly call it a town. It's just a little village. Oh. I have whatever you wanted. All right. So those things I got you to grab aren't actually for me. They're for you. As well as making trade deals, you can craft items to trade. Crafted items generally trade for a higher price, which is nice. Here is the recipe to craft a bundle of sticks with those items you grabbed. Just remember, you need a recipe and the correct items to craft. Sweet! Cool. Got a new recipe. Um, are you the one that uh, said I could stay? Uh. That yang fish is a rare fish, all right. Sneaky things only come out at dawn. Um, okay. Well... I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up on your roof here, and I am gonna save. There we go, new save. I guess that was that. Okay, well this game's fun. So, I will definitely be playing some more of this. I don't know how much more exactly, but uh, it's a lot of fun, so I don't know how much there is to this game, but I'll play it some more. And I'm going to do a little reading up on this game and see just how big and long and involved this game is, because it seems like it's going to be pretty big. Maybe it'll be another long play for me. Maybe I'll just play a couple episodes of it. Who knows? We'll see how fun it is and how well it goes. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you liked this video. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this game. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So you can join me next time for some more Yonder.